Bubbles spent her summer in a village. There, she saw people fetching water from two different wells. One well was near the houses, while the other was near the farms. She loved to fetch water from the well near her home, and she did it all the time. One afternoon, she felt thirsty while playing in the fields. She tried to fetch water from the well nearby, but it was very hard for her. She had to use a lot of force to raise half a bucket of water. She started wondering about the difference between the two wells. Why it was easy to raise water from the well near her home? Bubbles found it easier to raise the bucket from the well near her home because it had a pulley on it. There was no pulley on the well near the farms. So, what is a pulley? A pulley is a simple machine. It is a grooved wheel over which a rope or a chain is passed. The grooved wheel or pulley rotates on an axle as the rope moves through it. Let's have a closer look at how pulleys make our lives easier. A pulley is used to lift heavy objects by attaching a load to one side of the rope and pulling the rope from the other side. It can be used to either lower or raise the load. In what direction should force be applied in order to raise this bucket of water? To raise this bucket, we pull it upwards. This upward or downward direction of force is called the direction of force. Using a pulley, we pull the rope downwards to lift the bucket. This is how we change the direction of force with the pulley. The pulley that we saw on the well is attached or fixed to a ceiling or a rigid support. This is called a fixed pulley. The weight of the bucket of water is 16 newtons. Newton is the unit to measure force and weight. To raise this bucket of water, we need to exert a force of 16 newtons. So, in a fixed pulley, the force we apply to lift an object should be equal to the weight of the object. Consider a pulley where a bucket is attached to the pulley like this. One side of the rope is attached to a fixed support and force is applied on the other end. As we pull up the free end of the rope, the pulley and the load also move upwards. This is called a movable pulley. Are you experiencing any difference while lifting the bucket using a movable pulley? The bucket seems lighter because the hook supports half of the object's weight and we need to apply force equal to the remaining half of the weight to lift it. Therefore, to lift the same bucket, we need to exert a force of 30 newtons. But a movable pulley has a drawback. To raise a load, we need to apply force upwards and the direction of force can't be changed. As a result, we can raise the load only up to our level. To change the direction of force and to apply less force, we can combine fixed and movable pulleys like this. This combination is called a pulley system. In a pulley system, the weight of the load is distributed on the pulleys. Therefore, we need to exert less force to lift an object. To lift the same bucket of 60 newtons, we need to exert a force of 20 newtons. Pulley systems may also have more than two pulleys. Increasing the number of pulleys decreases the amount of force needed to lift an object. So, using a pulley system with many pulleys, a man can lift a car with a very small amount of force. Let's look at some other uses of pulleys. Besides wells, pulleys are used in flagpoles. A pulley is fixed at the top of the flagpole 
through which a rope passes. The rope is pulled downwards from the other side to raise the flag. A pulley system, that is a combination of fixed and movable pulleys, is used in cranes to lift heavy loads. Pulley systems are also used at construction sites, ports, and shipyards to lift and move heavy materials. Let's summarize what we have learned today. A pulley is a simple machine consisting of a grooved wheel over which a rope or chain is passed. A pulley is used to lift heavy objects at ports, industries, and building sites. They can also change the direction of force. Fixed pulleys, movable pulleys, and pulley systems are types of pulleys. If we increase the number of pulleys in a pulley system, the amount of force required to lift a load decreases.